Today we'll be making easy peasy hangover chili. I am so hungover today. Welcome back to another episode of Cook It Yourselves, where I'll teach you to cook it yourself. A few things we need. Onions, a single pepper, some minced beef, chopped tomatoes, tomato sauce, very cannellini beans, and some soup stock of any kind. I also have with me here a lager that is alcohol free that I think I'm gonna throw in. The director just called me a fuck face. Right now, I'm going to start cutting the onions and the chilli and then we're just going to dice it real quick and put it in a bowl. My eyes! My eyes! And now we're just... <coughs> oh my god, it's... We're gonna be, and now we're just gonna be slicing this. So now we're gonna start cooking. Uh, we got our olive oil here. We're gonna turn on the fire. Big luck, olive oil. Ooh. Now our onions and pepper goes in. We're gonna saute this until the onions are translucent. And now that the onions are translucent, we're gonna add our beef. I'll try to break it up right now so I don't have to do so much work with the spoon. Mmm! And now we're gonna just stir in our beef, you know, with the onions and the chilli, the pepper. We're gonna combine them, make sure it's all broken up so we get really good texture. So I forgot to mention earlier, at this point of time, you can add in any herbs, spices, you know, like basil or whatever you'd like, really, rosemary, uh, cumin. I'm gonna use a bit of garlic powder. And I also have some black pepper and I'm gonna just grind into it. At this point of time, I'm gonna add in the tomato sauce. We're also gonna add the chopped tomatoes right now. So I just drained the beans and now they're going in. So my pot's too small. I'm gonna change it out to a bigger pot. Alright, and now we're gonna add our stock. Need some salt. But even better than salt, I love fish sauce. I think it really helps to, you know, make the meat flavors come out a lot more. It really rounds out that flavor. So now I'm gonna pour the lager in and I'm just going to put it on really low heat heat after that and let it cook over a low and slow fire for about the next 40 minutes. Then I'll come back and taste it. And you know, I love making a huge pot like that because this means that I get to freeze it for the next time I'm hungover.
Alright, so now we're just going to let it sit for 40 minutes and then we'll come back to check on it. And now it's been 40 minutes, so we're going to look at our chilli and grab a bite. This is going to be so good for my hangover. Oh, and it smells amazing. <coughs> the dog's getting excited. So you can add some sour cream, but I only have ricotta right now, so I'm gonna add some ricotta in there and some parsley over it mm. Mm. Wow So meaty So flavorful Everything I need I love the beans This is the right balance for me. I, I think you guys should try it out. It is so good for a cold day, for a day after drinks, in the middle of the night. If you're hungry, you can put it over macaroni, over rice, anything at all. Like, share and subscribe and don't forget to let me know what you think. You know what? I think I'm ready for more drinks.